comes with an easy to understand instruction book. It's pretty simple to insert the batteries and hook it up to the computer. Okay, it comes with Duracells, but I plan on using rechargeable Anna loops. And you press this button, top pops off. It's fairly easy to put the batteries in. Press the button and it's back in shape. There's an on off button right there and the Bluetooth connector button and the laser. Okay, I'm going to try to show this in real time. I'm going to turn the button on. Now the manual says I have to go into settings, devices, Bluetooth, and it's searching and I click on Microsoft Sculpt Comfort Mouse. Now it says it's connected. And it does. The mouse moves around. It seems pretty fast. I'm going to have to go into settings and adjust stuff. In mouse properties I had to uncheck enhance pointy precision and it works a lot better and on Microsoft's website you can download the mouse and keyboard center program and it lets you customize the mouse and with the program you can adjust all the settings you can adjust what the little button does and it's funny, the one thing I wanted to do, it doesn't list. I wanted to just go to the desktop. Okay, I figured it out. You click on key combination, and you press that button right there, and then hit D. And now when you press the little blue button, you go straight to the desktop. And accuracy is pretty good. It's almost as good as the gaming mouse. If you were going to do heavy video editing, Photoshop work, or artwork, I would use the gaming mouse. But this seems good enough for just like normal web surfing and everyday use. The Logitech G400S mouse weighs 110 grams. And the Microsoft Sculpt mouse with the batteries weighs 137 grams. Still feels nice. Doesn't feel heavy. And while the Sculpt Mouse is a little smaller, it still feels comfortable. It has the thumb groove. Fingers lay nicely. With the G400S, buttons are nice. The scroll wheel is super quiet. Feels really good. Okay, the buttons. The right and left click buttons work real good. This button works, feels good. It's nice and smooth and quiet when I scroll down. But when I scroll up, it feels kind of ratchety, and it makes a funny noise. So I would say it's a decent mouse for 20 bucks. It's got Bluetooth capability, so you don't have to put a dongle, a Wi-Fi dongle in your computer, USB port.